Welcome back, people. You don't know, see a Siobhan Beckford here again on Factions News Commentary Jamaica Says Vox Pop Series. We're there at Emancipation Park right now, and the question for this week is Do you agree with the proposed COVID 19 restrictions for the Christmas holidays? Let us go in the street and hear what the people them have to say. So stick around, remember to like, share, and subscribe to the video, and leave a comment of what you think about this question. Restrictions are necessary as a result of our own discipline and it is more crucial because school needs to be open in January because too many of our students are being excluded because of various reasons and the best thing we can do for them is get them back into the system. Otherwise, we're going to have a long drawn out something and it's going to manifest itself years down the road. That's all right. I to say. Right, thank you, sir. I agree for the closer of the Christmas. Uh, it, you know why it's opening it. Uh, you know, cost too much people if you catch it. So I think best and keep it as how it is. All right, thank you, sir. Yeah, as man said, just work with what the government has said, you know what I mean? And just take the time, see if we can get over it. Simple as that. Alright, thank you, sir. Alright, so yes, I do agree with the restrictions. I feel like they're just trying to make us safe. Um, it's 7 o'clock on when? On Saturday? Um, on Christmas Day? I don't remember the exact protocol thing. But I think it makes sense. They're just trying to make us safe, if you ask me. So, yeah. All right, thank you. Yes, I do agree for the, um, the restriction for the Christmas holiday. One, because it will help prevent the spike. And um, also, will prevent some form, well, acting some, in, in some way as a, a deterrent to, to um, criminal activities. All right, thank you, sir. Yes, I um, I partially agree, but I, I think it sh you should have tighter restrictions like 3 p.m. on the holidays and stay-at-home orders. All right, thank you for that response, miss. I somewhat agree and do agree to you. I understand that, yes, we need to have measures, but the time, it's Christmas, family need to come together and stuff. Um, I do agree with the 10 o'clock, especially for like... New Year's Eve. I can't imagine myself having New Year's Eve um, to be at my house like 10 o'clock, but I guess he's doing what he needs to do. I don't know. Yeah. Alright, thank you for that response, sir. I think the 7 o'clock is a bit drastic. The 7 o'clock for the Christmas, because I mean, look at the look at the year, we could at least get the Christmas to enjoy ourselves. But I mean, I understand from the government's perspective that they want to, they, they know that Jamaicans are highly anticipating these events and parties so they're doing as much as they can to prevent it, um, these activities so it's kind of a kind of mixed feelings about it but probably probably like 8, 13, 9 keep it at the, keep it at the 9 then going all the way to 7 because this is the last major event of the year um, where families you know they want to enjoy themselves but Again, I can understand the, the safety precautions. All right, people. So thanks again for watching. You know, this is Factions News Commentary, Jamaica Says, Vox Pop Series. So that was what the persons had to say regarding the question and what they, if they agreed or they didn't agree with the proposed COVID-19 restrictions for the Christmas holiday. Remember to check out our other videos and to stick around for next week on what we have to offer and for next week's question. Remember to hit that subscribe and that like button. Alright, so signing out, I am your host for this week, Siobhan Beckford. Stay tuned.